Hello Cactus and Succulent Lovers and welcome to another video. In this uh, hopefully fairly short video I'm going to be doing an unboxing. Uh, in a previous um, video I uh, showed a cutting from my uh, Austrocylindra puntia subulata which was, a, was actually a cutting off this mother plant. Now this plant has been um, kept in a different location, not ideal conditions at all, not really enough sunlight, it's been on a windowsill, it's not been watered. It's actually grown quite quite rapidly, but if I turn it this way, you can see here that the growth is very uh, etiolated. It's been bending towards the window, really not had enough light. So perhaps that's a little bit deceptive. So Ziggy very kindly offered to send me a cutting of one of his uh, Ostracylindra puntia subulatas um, so that I can grow the two together in the same location. So um, I received a package the other day. I'm assuming that this is the, uh, um, the cutting he sent. So thank you very much, Ziggy. So let me just have a look and see what we've got in here. I've, not, I've opened it to speed up the video, but I haven't actually looked inside yet. So, ooh, there's actually multiple things in here. Let's um, look in here. Ah, Cylindra Puntia, oh, Whip, Whip, Whiplii, that's a different one, that's a lovely cutting that, that's a little bit different from, from this, <laughs> very spiky, <laughs> um, that's, that's absolutely beautiful, it doesn't have the side arms, it's got some, um, some vicious spines on it, um, oh, I should look forward to rooting that. And let's have a look here. Oh, this is long and thin. Pterocactus tub tuberosis. Wow, I've not seen one of these before. Um, I need to look that up to learn a bit more about it. That's absolutely beautiful. Um, very sort of long and thin. I'm, I'm presuming that they. They must bend over when they grow or something. Thank you very much for that, Ziggy. Um, and what else have we got here? This. Right, there we go. Oh, there's another one in there. I'll tell you what, I'll do the little one first. And we have, oh, <laughs> very hairy. This, this looks a little bit like the, um, let me see. Yes, Vestita. Oh, that's, that's brilliant. Thank you, Ziggy, so much for that. Um, I loved seeing your video of how they sort of dance around. So um, I will get this uh, rooted up um, as quickly as I can. And um, maybe maybe by this this time of next year, I'll have a, a nice big plant with that. That's uh, that's very kind. And here, this, this actually feels quite quite heavy. I think this is quite a large cutting here. Um, it's under the, oh, it's it's a rooted, uh, rooted. Oh wow, that's big. <laughs> wow, that is absolutely enormous. <laughs> that is that is absolutely brilliant, and it's interestingly it's rooted out the side. So I presume that that's been planted like that and has grown out of one end of it. So I, when I come to pot this up, I will do exactly the same, try and um, try and keep it sort of happy. Um, that's absolutely beautiful cutting, Ziggy. Thank you so much for that. And uh, we can see the, um, the, the main part here is quite a bit thicker than my one. Um, obviously, I'm not very familiar with exactly what your growing conditions are and how they compare to mine, but um, what, I, what I hope to do is get um, this and the cutting I took from this growing in the same conditions in the same location so I can do a comparison. Um, the suspicion is that this may be a Monstro's version um, but it was just sold as a standard um, Ostracylindra puntia subulata um, and I'm fairly new to this so I don't really have the means to um, identify the different uh, different plants. So Let's go have this a minute. 
Just like to say a massive thank you, Ziggy, for sending me all these other um, other cuttings. I, I wasn't expecting all of these. This is absolutely brilliant. Um, I'm very grateful, um, and I will get these um, get these rooted. Um, I'm presuming they may need to callus over a little bit longer before I I do that, but that's uh, that's not a problem. So we have Ostracylindroprontia vestita, Terracactus tuberosus. Ostracylindropuntia subulata and what was this one again? Os uh, sorry, Cylindropuntia whiplii. Yeah, well. So, thank you very much for watching, everyone. Um, I will uh, put a link up at the top here to um, to Ziggy's cactus channel. Um, it, he's got a whole load of uh, um, interesting videos about uh, these cacti and many other um, other plants as well. And I'd like to say thank you for watching and uh, do like the video and subscribe if you haven't already done so. Until next time, happy cactusing everybody.